Hello there, welcome to this video. This is another zero training video. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to lock the date on zero accounting software. That means that the date that's locked, transactions dated on or before that date cannot be edited or deleted in any way. You also can't add transactions to zero that are dated on or before the date that's locked. So it kind of freezes the software to the lock date so data cannot be changed. It's ideal for a year end that's finished. The accountant has sent the year end adjustments. They're on the system. You can lock everything so it doesn't change. Or perhaps you do a month end, some sort of period end, and you want to lock everything so no one can change the data and, um, and make things incorrect how you do it. You go to the top left here, click on the company name, go to settings, go to advanced settings, and then financial settings. If this is starred, it will actually show in the accounting tab. So if you want to have access to this in future much easier, just star it and it will appear in that accounting tab. So financial settings, then scroll down to the bottom, we have lock dates. There are two options. You can lock the date for all users except advisors. So if you have any advisors that are on zero who have access to your zero software, they'll still be able to change things. But if you want everybody to be locked, all users, then use this bottom box. So if I was to select, say, 31st of March 2023 and click save, the data is now locked to that date. No one can make any changes to the financial data on or before this date. It's very simple and straightforward. If for whatever reason you do need to then change zero for a date dated on or before this date, you can just come back here, change the date, save, make your changes and change it back. Nice and easy. We love zero. Thank you for watching. Feel free to watch more of my free videos. I can teach you everything and anything about zero accounting software.